All right, hi class. As you know, we have an upcoming project where we choose a quote and we choose two pictures and we put them all together in um, our new edit, edit imaging uh, software, Pixlr. Um, so now I'm gonna show you how to do this. I've got my quote right here and the two pictures I chose. And right now I'm just gonna put them all together. I'm gonna show you a little bit of how that works. Um, first, let's uh, deal with this quote a little bit. So what we're going to do is we're going to go to this text box. When I, I press the quote, I go into this text. I press the text, and now I have this right here. I chose this font, and I want it to be white because I want it to match this chalk right here. Um, that's used. I'm going to make it a little smaller, and I'm going to put it up at the top. I want it to kind of look a little rough, so I'm going to turn it a little bit. So, um, and yeah, I think that looks really cool. Um, one thing, one other thing I'm gonna do, cause I want it to look rough, like I said, is I'm going to make the transparency go down just a little bit. Um, perfect. Um, and now, yeah, I really like how that looks. My quote's from the Lorax, and so I wanted to incorporate this bird in there because I think birds are a really important part of our environment, obviously. And as you can see down there, I have a tree bark, and I want to bring the tree bark to the front of it. Like, all of this is kind of put on top of the tree bark. So what I'm going to do here now is I'm actually going to um, go to the bird picture, and I'm going to go to cutout, see here? Um, and I'm going to go to Magic Cutout up here, um, and this is going to do something really cool. It's, it uses AI to kind of um, pick out what uh, you might want to be in and what you might want to be out of the picture. So this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to press some places in here, and yeah, look, um, now my bird is kind of outside um, of itself. I, will, I didn't want it to be this much, so I'm going to um, add a little more. So how I add a little more of the bird picture is I'm going to press keep, and I'm going to press the draw cutout. And now, and I'm going to make it a little bigger so I can add as much as I want. Um, and now I'm going to go like this. I'm going to add some. It's going to look green at first, but then as soon as I let go, it will be like this. And so now it shows a little bit of the background. I'm going to add some of the background in here. And actually, I'm going to make it smaller because I didn't want to show all of this, um, all of this uh, green work right here, all of these leaves and stuff. So I'm going to take out some of that right there, yep, and take out some of that, make it look really cool. All right, perfect. Now I've got a really cool picture that I just did in a few minutes. Um, but what I want to do is I want to make this just a little more transparent. I'm again going to right click on here and make it a little more transparent. And yeah, see, now the words aren't the main focus of the picture. And I really like that. So basically, um, there's a bunch of different things you can do. Um, when I want to finish the photo, I can go like this and I'm going to merge, um, I'm going to merge all the visible images into one. So now I have just one image, and then I can just edit the whole image of how I want it to look. I can change the colors that show in it, I can change the saturation, and all of this stuff you can play with and mess with, contrast, look at that, make it a little darker, go like this. And this is kind of just general Im image editing stuff, um, but you can do so much with, this th with these things, and if you don't want to do it all the way, you can change the blur on it, uh, make it a little different. Um, and you can see, you can make it even transparent a little bit so you can post it on something else. Um, you can change something like this, make it a little more artsy, do, some, do a lot of creative things. Do this, make it really uh, graphic. Uh, there's so many different things you can do with this uh, image editing. And I just want to uh, show you a little bit of what I did and so that you can um, do it yourself. Uh, thanks and have a nice day, guys.